let's summarize. In projectile motion at an angle, we have two simultaneous at the same time motion. The sideways motion is constant velocity. And of course, the math for that is very simple. And the up and down motion is uh, uniform acceleration, exactly the same as a ball thrown up and returning to the hand. Uh, it might be good to review that material. So to clarify, we'll look at another example. And what I want you to see are three balls. The first one is a ball that is thrown at an angle, projectile motion at an angle. The second will be constant velocity along a level ground. And the third is a ball that is thrown up and down. So here we go. The first ball on top will be our projectile that will be launched at a particular velocity, at a particular angle. And of course, we have two components, the horizontal and the vertical. The bottom ball will be launched sideways at the moment the first projectile is released, and it will move at a constant velocity, a velocity equal to the horizontal component of the projectile. Watch what happens. The horizontal motion is constant velocity. Now we'll look at the vertical component. This projectile will be launched, it has a velocity, and Another projectile will be thrown directly up in the air with an initial velocity equal to the vertical component of the projectile. Now watch what happens. The vertical motion is identical to an object thrown up and down and is completely independent of the sideways motion.